concludes Ms. Hendricks written statement. However, there is another statement that I would like to make again on behalf of the family, yes. on behalf of the community, the lawyers involved, and the hundreds upon hundreds upon the hundreds of calls I've received in the last uh, maybe 36 hours. Your Honor, we implore you, we beg you, yes. not to accept this plea agreement. Yes. Yeah. It's disrespectful. Yes. It's disrespectful to the family. It's disrespectful to the community. Yes. And it isn't warranted. Based on the facts, a sitting grand jury in Davidson County indicted Andrew Delkey on first degree premeditated murder. Ms. Hambrick, for the last three years, has been trying to get mentally ready for July 12th. The days have changed over time, but get ready for that trial. That's the only bit, the only semblance of any justice she may receive for the three bullets that struck and killed her son. She waited. The state, the district attorney's office, in violation of her rights as a victim, did not consult her, did not contact her about the plea negotiations they all in secret had to get rid of this case, just to get rid of it. No one consulted her. Your Honor, yesterday about 2.30 p.m., she found out for the first time that the deal had been done, mm -hmm. that it was a foregone conclusion, mm -hmm. that his fate had already been determined. Mm -hmm. They didn't need a jury right. because white men decided. Mm -hmm. They decided what was best mm -hmm. for this community and for Ms. Hambrick. Judge, you have the power. The power is used across the state and other states too. You can reject this plea deal. You can say not on my watch. I'm not accepting this plea deal. And we're begging you. The citizens are begging you, Judge Monty Watkins, to do the right thing and reject this plea deal. It's not fair. It's not justice. It's not justice. Ms. Hambrick is continuously looking for justice and getting slapped in the face and slapped down and treated in an inhumane way. Not even the common courtesy to say, hey, let's talk about this. We want to talk about settling. It was an announcement made to her yesterday where the DA said, I've, I've done it. This is what I'm doing. This is my office. That's it. We're asking you now, Judge. We're asking you, you're the last one that we can come to, yes. that we can turn to Judge Watkins. You're it. Yes. The buck stops there. We're asking you to reject this plea deal. Yes, sir. Please. Like judges do all the time. Yes. In the interest of justice, based on every shred of evidence you've heard, based on the fact that her rights were violated, yes. and based on the fact that 12, well, not on, however many were on the grand jury, strangers decided that they were going to indict this man on a first degree premeditated charge. We ask you that, Your Honor.
Let me go! 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 Let me go!